section um this is part two of um, our question solving if you haven't checked um the other video the first video we uploaded for number one number two and three a now we'll continue from three b we'll continue from here so we are going to continue down here there are lots of questions for us to solve so um if you haven't check i've uploaded a video on the solution of from number one to number three a so we'll continue from three b so we have three b the question says we should solve for x in the inequality so we have two over three two s plus five which is less or equal to a to number two over five okay okay so we have this question we have a miss fashion we have changed to improper fashion so we have 2 over 3 here 2s plus 5 here it is less or equal so changing it to um, improper fashion 5 times 8 is yeah. 5 times 8 is 40 plus 2 42 over 5 so we have this now we have um, the denominators the denominator to be 3 and 5 so um, the LCM of 3 and 5 so LCM of 3 and 5 we can um, have the common one to be 15 so from here we multiply multiply all size by 15 so we have 15 here multiplies 2 over 3 here into bracket we have 2x plus 5 then we have 42 over 5 here multiplies that of 15 3 goes into itself and goes into 15 5 times 5 goes up and goes into 15 3 times so 5 times 2 is just 10 and we have 2x plus 5 here less or equal to 42 times 3 so 42 times 3 so 10 times 2 is just 20x 10 times 5 here is just 50 less or equal to 42 times um, times 3 being 126 so we group like times 2x here less or equal to 1 2 6 negative 50 negative 50 then we have 2x here and equal to 126 minus 50 yeah is yes, 76 divided so we do have both side by 20 20 it's cancel out then goes into 20 five. then we have um, here to be 19 yeah so that's 76 divided by 20 we have this so we have 19 divided by 5 which is um, in decimal form is 3 point about 3.8 now the question says we should um, we should illustrate the solution on the number line so we have a number line here so for the number line we have uh, our number line so we have uh, it is around 3.2 so therefore let's say 2 point negative 2 negative 1 here 0 1 2 3 let's say 4 and it goes on in that manner so 3.8 so let's say 5 is here need to be somewhere somewhere here and so therefore s is less or equal to 19 over 5 which is yeah which is same as 3.8 so we have this and if you look at the direction it is going in this direction going to this direction so 
this go into the direction we have this goes into that direction and therefore we can shade it because it is less or equal to therefore we shade it because of the equal to we shade it and it goes into this direction so basically that's the normal line we have here yeah so we have question four here now the question four says giving m equal to this so we are giving m being equal to r minus all over 2 and r yeah so we should make r the subject so we are making r there is r here and there is r here so we are making r the subject so the first thing is to we can first thing is to cross is to cross multiply so cross multiply sorry m is over one so this goes to multiply that and this goes to multiply that so we have 2m multiplying that so m multiplies 2m and we have 2 m and r being equal to 1 multiplies this r minus x here so r minus x here so we cross multiply so making all the subjects we have how here and how here therefore we have to group like terms so 2m how here how causes is positive when it cause become negative r and what is left here is this negative x so we have how here how here therefore i can factorize r out so r comes out i love it 2mn minus 1 equal to negative x when I multiply this whole thing, I should I get this. So, what I have to do next is to divide both sides by this. Divide here also by that. So, realize that this gets for all of that. And I have my arrow here equal to negative x over 2mn minus 1. So, therefore, arrow here is this. The question says, the question says, if S is that, M is that, and N is negative 3, then we should calculate the value of R. So, we should calculate that. So, basically, if, if S is 117, m is 2 and n is negative 3 so if we have this then what is the value of r so r will be equal to so wherever we see the variable x we substitute which is 117 m substituted by 2 and substituted by negative 3 so we have um, negative here s is 117 being divided by 2 here m here m here is 2 so we have 2 here n here is negative 3 minus 1 so we have our here being equal to negative 170 2 times 2 is 4 4 times negative 3 so we have 4 times negative 3 which is negative 12 minus 1 here so we have negative here 17 over negative 13 negative cancel that of negative and in all 13 goes into each of once and 30 goes into this 9 so we have 9 so therefore our here is equal to 9 so this will we simply have for question 4 And finally, we have our last question. It's an angle question. Now, we have this um, diagram here. It is not drawn to scale. Now, in the figure PQR, so in the figure Q here, 
is a straight line. Angle TQP is as so this angle which is TQP and we have TQS so we have TQ and X is this angle and we have um, SQR so SQ and R is that and we know uh, okay and we know so the B part we know angles on a on a straight line is equal to 180 degrees so what we have to do now is to sum the whole of this and equate it to 180 so we have tqp sums that of t so tqs and sums that of sqr being equal to 180 so tqp which is this is this s degree and we have um, tqs being 102 degrees sqr being 2x this we have 180 that so we sum the whole of this so s 1 102 so we group like terms from this so so we have two s this then we have 180 this goes to the other side it's positive it becomes negative 102 degrees and we have s times 2s that's 3s degree then we have then we have 180 minus that yeah so 180 minus 102 is 78 degrees so we divide here by 3 divide here by 3 3 cancel that 3 goes into 7 and goes into 28 26 times so therefore as degree here is equal to 26 degree and that's what we have for the value of s so we have to calculate the value of x so therefore this is the value of x so thank you very much and for joining me in this, in this section and um if you want the solution to question one to question three here uh, it's in the first video i uploaded so check out the first video which is on top of the screen you can check out the solution over there from question one to question three so thank you very much and please subscribe bye